Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today is Friday the 31st of May. With LEGO releasing their first wave of summer sets tomorrow, or they're already out if you're watching this in the future, they're already concentrating on August, September and beyond, and even Christmas release sets, and there's a lot of them. So I've had a good look through the site, I've put them all together, and we're going to go through them. We've got stuff from Star Wars, Technic, Marvel, Dreams, City, Mario, Sonic, Animal Crossing, and even the Advent Calendars. So as always, let's cut the chit chat and jump straight in. So first up, we have got this absolute masterpiece. It is from the video game The Legend of Zelda, and it is the Great Deku Tree 2-in-1 build. Set number 77092, two and a half thousand pieces, available from the 1st of September at 259.99, and it just looks absolutely stunning. Fans of the video game are definitely gonna love this one. So next up from Lego Art, we've got the Mona Lisa. Now originally this was due out around now, but they've pushed it back to October the 1st. Comes in at 89.99, set number 31213, 1,503 pieces. I'm not really into the Lego art, but this one's not too bad. It's got a nice looking frame. The gold bricks really do pop. So yeah, I can see this one doing well with the Lego art fans. So next up, we've got one from Star Wars, and it is the Imperial Star Destroyer. Available from the 1st of August at 149.99. Set number 75394, 1,555 pieces. And it comes with seven minifigs, including a collectible Cal Kestis figure, which is nice. Moving on to Technic, and we have got four sets available from the 1st of August. The first one being, and I love the look of this, this is the NASA Apollo Lunar Roving Vehicle. 189.99, set number 42182, 1,913 pieces. Some great attention to detail on here, and I love those tyres. We've then got the Kunizeg Jesko Absolute Grey Hypercar. 46.99, again available from 1st of August. Set number 42173, 801 pieces. We've then got the Porsche GT4 e-performance race car, 149.99. Set number 42176, 834 pieces. And then finally from Technic, we've got the Volvo FMX truck and EC230 electric excavator, 169.99. Set number 42175, 2,274 pieces. Unfortunately, all we've got is the box art at the moment. We then move on to Marvel and they've got six sets so far lined up for 1st of August and there is some cracking sets here. This one especially and I think this is going to do well. This is the Avengers Assemble Age of Ultron 89.99 set number 76291 613 pieces and it comes with nine minifigs. Cracking looking set this. We then got the Milano spaceship from Guardians of the Galaxy 159.99 set number 76286 2,090 pieces and comes with five minifigs. Well, four and a half because you got a little tiny baby group one there. Now speaking of group, we've got a new dancing group, 39.99, set number 76297, 459 pieces. Next up, we've got the Avengers vs. Leviathan, 44.99, set number 76290, 347 pieces and comes with five minifigs. Next up, we've got Thor vs. Surtar construction figure, 24.99, set number 76289, 245 pieces. And then finally for Marvel, we've got Iron Man and Iron Legion vs. Hydra Soldier, 19.99, set number 76288, 135 pieces. We then move on to Lego Dreams, and we have got eight sets being released on the 1st of August. I don't follow Lego Dreams, so forgive me if I'm chuckling because some of these sets look very odd. <laughs> The first one being Logan the Mighty Panda, 24.99, set number 71480, 342 pieces. I guess this is all based off your dreams, and some people dream of big pandas with firing rocket guns. We then move on to Izzy's Dream Animals, 34.99, set number 71481, 328 pieces. We then got Zoe's Cat Motorcycle, 17.99, set number 71479, 226 pieces. We've then got the Never Witch's Midnight Raven, 8999, set number 71478, 1203 pieces. Was that some kind of Ghostbuster bloke down there with the thing on his back? Very strange. We've then got the Never Witch's Nightmare Creatures, 3999, set number 71483, 457 pieces. Some nice detail on this one. This is Castle Nocturnia, 169.99, 
Set number 71486, 1,360 pieces, and it comes with six minifigs. Now this one looks quite cool. This is Mateo and Z Blob, <laughs> the Night Battle Mech, 114.99. Set number 71485, 1,333 pieces. Quite a few minifigs in this one. And again, that flying bird with the vase thing. Is that a significant part of Dreams? It seems to be in most of the sets. Pop a comment below if it is. And then last up for Dreams, we have got Cooper's Robot Dinosaur C-Rex 69.99, set number 71484, 917 pieces. Moving on to Lego City now, and we've got one set scheduled for 1st of August, and it is the Downtown Streetcar and Station, set number 60423, 811 pieces. We then move on to Super Mario, and we've got eight sets lined up for the 1st of August, the first one being Goomba's Playground. 12.99, set number 71433, 173 pieces. We've then got three adventures with an interactive Lego, featuring Peach, Mario and Luigi. First one being Peach, 44.99, set number 71441, 208 pieces. We've then got Mario, same price, 44.99, set number 71439, 218 pieces. And then we've got Luigi, 44.99, set number 71440, 210 pieces. Moving on, we've got the Soda Jungle Maker Set, 49.99. Set number 71434, 598 pieces. This one looks really cool. This is King Boo's Haunted Mansion, 64.99. Set number 71436, 932 pieces. Love the colour of the roof, it's really nice. We've then got Battle with Roy at Peach's Castle, 59.99, set number 71435, 738 pieces. And then finally for Mario, we have got the Bowser Express Train, and this looks really cool. It's 104.99, set number 71437, 1,392 pieces. Really colourful looking set, that. And now we've got Sonic the Hedgehog. Three sets available from the 1st of August. First one, Knuckles and the Master Emerald Shrine. Set number 76998, 325 pieces. We've then got Tails' Adventure Boat, 49.99. Set number 76997, 393 pieces. And then finally for Sonic, we've got Super Sonic vs Egg Drillster, 69.99. Set number 76999, 590 pieces. Couple of sets from Animal Crossing due to be released on the 1st of August. The first one being KK's Concert at the Plaza. 69.99, set number 77052, 550 pieces. And then we've got Fly with Dodo Airlines, 31.99, set number 77051, 292 pieces. We now move on to some Christmas sets. Yes, I said Christmas, and it is only the 31st of May. But these are the advent calendars, and we've got six available from the 1st of September. The first one being Star Wars. 29.99, set number 75395, 368 pieces. And it comes with some cracking minifigures. I'm loving Luke and Leia's Christmas jumpers. We've got Ahsoka Tanu. We've got some little mini builds in there. Got the X-Wing and there's the Land Speeder there. Oh, there's some really good little builds there. I'm definitely going to pick this one up. at at the top there. The Razor Crest I can see. Yeah, definitely going to pick this one up. We've then got Harry Potter, 29.99, set number 76438, 301 pieces. Some nice minifigs and mini builds in there. We've then got Spider-Man, 29.99, set number 76293, 246 pieces. We've then got a Disney advent calendar, 29.99 again, set number 43253, and features a few minifigs in that one as well. Some from Frozen, Encanto, Ariel the Mermaid I can see, looks like Moana, and some nice little mini builds as well, the castle, etc. We've also got a Lego City calendar coming in at 19.99, bit cheaper, set number 60436, 195 pieces. And then finally for the advent calendars we've got Lego Friends, again 19.99, bit cheaper, set number 42637, 272 pieces. So last up for this video I thought I would add this in and Lego announced the other day that they are releasing sets from the upcoming movie stroke musical Wicked and these are due to be released on October the 1st. At the moment they've just got a holding advertising page on their website and it's got this massive banner which says pink clicks good with green and there are five of these blobs that pull out of the actual screen. Now there's rumours that these indicate there's going to be five sets 
we've got like a, a castle there a butterfly and there's another castle down there we've also got the witch's hat there on the right it looks like the witch's hat and then down on the bottom we've got this kind of aerial view of four houses I don't, I'm not sure what that is if you know any more put a comment below because I'm really not sure what these are but I'm sure they'll release more info soon and as soon as I get it I'll put it out there as to what these are gonna be so that's gonna do it for this mammoth video of even more sets being released this summer from Lego I'm sure they will announce even more between now and then and if they do I'll put out more videos Pop a comment below if you got your eye on any of the sets. Let us know what you're looking forward to. But that's it. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And don't forget to ding that notification bell to let you know when new videos are released. Thanks again and I'll catch you in the next one. See ya.